Hi everyone, today we're going to be looking at how you can use the Gaussian Blur. Now before we start, let's go to View, go to Windows Layout and click on Default Layout. This just ensures that me and you are both looking at the same layout. Next we're going to add in a media file. So I already have a media file, you can just drag and drop it. And then we are going to add it into the timeline. Now we have a media file and we can see the video preview in the top right section as well. Next, we are going to apply the blur to a specific section of this video. So I am going to, let's say the middle section of the video, I'm going to split it here. You can press S on your keyboard to split it or by right clicking and splitting it here. So this is the section of the video we're going to apply the blur to. Next, we click on video effects and find Gaussian blur here. So here it is. All you need to do is drag and drop into that specific section of the video and you should be able to see it in the preview window. Now, if you cannot see it, don't worry. This is because maybe you have the split screen view enabled. So you need to have this split screen view disabled for you to see the blur in the preview window. If you have this enabled, you can see it just disappears. If you have this enabled, it's there. So if you have it enabled, you may not uh, see the blur. So if we play the video, we can see the blur taking effect here. And that's it. Now to remove this, all you need to do is click on event effects. Here's the Gaussian blur. It's already selected. And on the right here, it says remove selected plugin. Click on that and that's it. It's removed. And that's pretty much it. Thanks everyone. I hope you found this video helpful.